Hi guys, so lots of times we don't know what kind of activities to have with our kids here in Canada. So but there are lots of activities. You can go to the park, you can go to a museum, you can go to the movies. And the one that I like the best, you can go to the library. So join me as I take my son for some fun and not so fun activities around Canada that you too can take your children to. Let's go. If you have kids in Canada, try and take them to the library. You can register and your kids can borrow all sorts of books to read. Their games and all sorts. And I'm saying children because a lot of adults don't like to read. But reading is good for everybody. It's not just for children. So we are just returning some books that were taken. Um, it's usually like 14 days or three four books. And then also we have some video games. Apparently these are new materials. I think that there was a book about friends. We don't really like this diary of a wimpy kid. Okay, so I don't usually have a lot of time for pleasure reading, but I think that I want to start building that into my day. Just something to relax with. Mm, this is something in my room. It's kind of at work. Because they have an assortment of video games, Xbox, um, Xbox 360, and then Nintendo. Nintendo. And even borrow a console, the Switch console. And then, of course, there are books of all, all genres, like all ages. Any kind of book, fiction, non fiction, whatever it is your child likes, whatever you like. This one is children, non fiction, and yeah, children, fiction, all oh, so I'm sure you find something in the library. And there's so many books. Like here, we have three floors, right? Three floors completely of books. We have reading spaces, we have a gamer space, all sorts. I think it's a very educative place to bring children to. And of course, in these days of AI, they also have a robot here that helps. Uh, there's a female robot, you can see she's sleeping now, they just start on her, tell her where to go, say eat, craft, and then say start, and then she starts going. So she usually will take you to the place where you want to go. So I put in kids craft, she'll take you there, you can load your books onto her, she'll take you to where you check out, and then you check out. So you don't have to really do what you just follow her especially if you don't know where that place is she'll take you there and direct you so this is the kids section it's very beautiful like they have all sorts of things to play with these are games adult games kid games all sorts see the play area children come here to play craft on These are crafts for children. Craft corner. You can see all the craft we've done. Drawing. It's really cool. Really cool. Then of course we can look outside. Yeah. So I know a lot of parents bring their kids here over the weekend just to relax. So parents relax, children relax, and everybody has fun. Like I said before, this is a really big library of like three floors. not so bad or you don't slide this way a little bit yep there you go where did you go? Uh, um, 
Rachel, yeah. I left him a spot in the lineup with a blank okay, white sheet. Yeah. <laughs> Squeeze a fist. Just don't move. Don't move, Sam. That's it. That's it, honey. You okay? had come now that's how I'm struggling with this thing. Hi guys, hi everybody. So today is like um open day at my son's school and that's where I'm headed now. So let's go together. Just getting here to the school like there are already lots of guys here. So I'm a bit late but I'll catch up okay there you are so we're just like getting in now so we just got into the school and we're doing a tour of the school so we're just in the school classroom now this thing slides down This is actually a wall where they have like you know awards. Um, so these are like lockers. Yeah. Can you see his locker? Empty. I mean, guys, can you imagine that this is a classroom? It looks cool. It's too cozy. By the way, this is great. Seven. Can you imagine the classroom? The nice. first time I saw the pictures for this classroom, I was this like, is just what? Amazing. Is this a class? It's Let me so show cozy. you more of the classroom. Can you see that fireplace? Oh, guys. To so, this is what we know. Okay, guys. Can you see that? Timetable. Enjoy little things. Like, I just love this classroom. It's cool. I mean, look at how cozy it is. There's little lights and stuff. <laughs> Beautiful. Wow. I'm just thrilled by this fireplace. The Canadian flag. Uh, the classroom looks really tech. Lots of tools for them Hi guys can you see this this is still part of the classroom awesome okay thank you for that and like you also have a great view i mean look at all that green it's a beautiful view she wasn't. That's your teacher. Now we're heading to the gym where the action is there's food there, there's drinks, and there's other parents there as well. So, this is the gym where we have come to get uh, slices of pizza as well as drinks, also to meet and greet with other parents that you might know, the children to meet and greet with their friends. <laughs> I always enjoy this open day activities because it's just an opportunity for me to meet my son's friends, meet other friends, want to network. I want us to make one or two friends. Sweet break from my so day. So we actually got pizza and drinks and we sat down to just you know, grab them. <laughs> and this girl was just giving us gymnastics. Uh -uh. <laughs> There were so many children there, running around, having fun, playing. It was just a sight to see and an opportunity to relax.
I hope you're having fun so far. It feels really cool, doesn't it? So we're done networking, we're done eating, we're done looking at the class and all of that. So we're on our way home. It wasn't a very long stay, but it was an opportunity to meet his new teacher, you know, see the classroom, talk about my son a bit, you know, and also to network. And we're just going towards the car now. It was fun. So that's it, guys. Thanks for coming along with me. Hope you had fun, as much fun as I did. Thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.